Good morning, good day, and good evening. Welcome back to Rise of the Tomb Raider, guys. My name is Mike, and I think Laura is basically ready to get back into some Tomb Raider action. Uh, leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed this episode. I am actually a little bit uh, behind on how I was last episode since I had to... Alright. Since I had to reload the game, so this is basically where we were. And I'm gonna keep trying to do whatever I can to survive. Use some of these Molotovs. I actually want to get all these guys in the first tray without dying. Maybe that'll do it. Oh my god, there's a guy with a ride shield. I didn't even notice. Oh wow, he killed himself. That's surprising. And you know what? They're killing each other with those explosives. I always find that a flaw. I mean, even though it's awesome and it's easy as fuck and it's kind of funny, I think that's one of the flaws in this game is the NPCs kill each other. Let me see if I can get that. Ooh, what a throw by Lara. Oh my god, I forgot to ignite it. Holy shit. Alright, you know what? I'm going to end it once and for all. Just need to get him on my sight. Come on, man. Come on, dude. Get back in the action. Don't be holding out on me, bruh. Don't be holding out on me. Oh, there he is. Okay. Bang, 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 bang. Whoa! <laughs> Holy shit! What the fuck? He's not even dying. You know, he's got the body of steel right there. Non-Superman type. That was pretty easy. Alright, let's head up here because I know we're supposed to go up this way. Because we're going to have to find another way... To get... Wait, can I unlock this? Alright, we got lockpicks for once in our life! Ain't that some great news we got. Ooh, we need one more part for the semi-automatic pistol. That's all in good fun. What's this bag of tricks? A little map updated. Alright, so we need to um, get the second part of the door unlocked. Last episode we got that part over there in that area. If you didn't see it, I'll leave a link in the description. Go watch that! Uh, and we have to get this side open now, so I guess we're just gonna zip line to this side. Hopefully not fall! Almost got it. We need to, uh, head down toward that waterfall. But I am really enjoying this game. And this mission is pretty uh, I love the mines. I really like the scenery in the mines. I mean, look at it. It's so beautiful. But anyways, guys, I hope your day is going great. I really do. Mine's going swell, I have to say. I'm ready for more Tomb Raider, guys. I have not uploaded for the past two days because I've been indulging myself into fucking schoolwork. And it was hell, I'll tell you. It was, it was shitty as fuck. And I'm happy to be back with Tomb Raider. And some video games. Video games are good to play. And they're fun to play. So, what I remember is... Okay. There's a wheel, I think. Here we go. Right here. If I can get to it. I'm not really sure how this is going to work. Hopefully it does. And... Wait for it. It's like that game Cut the Rope on the iPhone. If you ever played that, go check it out. Okay, how am I supposed to... Do I get on top? Aren't I supposed to cut this? What what good would that do, though? Should be a way to move it into the water with that rope wedge. Maybe push this once more? There we go. Actually, no. I, I'm surprised I can't... What the fuck? I can't even cut the rope? Since when did that happen? Can I pull this back a little bit? I guess so. Maybe this is the right way? Oh, that did something. We're getting somewhere. There we go. There we go. Oh my god, we gotta go, Ben. This place is gonna collapse on us. Shit, shit, shit on a stick. Jesus, save me! 
And kaboom! He made it. Like Lara always does. That cardio, though. Okay, let's get into the doorway. Uh, uh, I don't like it. I don't like it. Oh, fuck, that scared me. Well, that was a close one. the exodus of his people from the deserts of Syria. They settled in a hidden valley and built a great city. Kadesh. To protect the city and its people, the Prophet raised an army of warriors. But what is this showing? It's not the divine source they're holding. Something else, something else, but what? And his warriors forged for him an atlas. That the prophet might always know his city and its secrets. A map of the city. It could show the way to the divine source. Huh. Enter the valley. But I, this place is so cool! Whoa! Look at that! Look at that prophet statue! He's at peace! You know, this reminds me of the Bioshock Infinite. Even though he wasn't really the prophet. Uh, Zachary Comstock's statue. In the city of... What was it called? Columbia? That's what it reminds me of. I don't know. Alright, I'm gonna search this little room for loot. Or big room, sorry. And then we'll head out into the valley, because that's what it wants us to do. Clearly. Can I light these? Okay, I thought those were candles, but clearly not. Wait a minute. I'm not supposed to go this way, are we? No. I always like to find the little loot, or even secrets. There's a lot of secrets in this game. I love mystery. Especially in shows. It's you should watch the shows. Still standing. I guess that's why I like Lost so much. The mystery of it. Oh shit. I hate when that happens. Fuck! Man, those things are so surprising. It's kind of frustrating. Because you gotta wait again. You gotta redo it. And you don't know when it's gonna happen. Sometimes it even gets me. I, I, I don't know why. Sometimes I jump. I'm just a big old baby. Alright, how do I dive again? I completely forget how to dive. There we go. Tap B to repeatedly move faster. Don't want to drown again. We all know that deal. Alright. Not in the valley yet. Still have ways to go. Oh, great. Oh, great. Don't die, Laura. Please, please, just give me this one chance. Oh, beauty. You see that, guys? Right through this doorway. This beautiful nature. Here we go. Oh, my goodness. Geothermal Valley. The definition of next-gen gaming. You know what I'm surprised about is this game was actually on Xbox 360, too. And I was thinking, what the hell? How? I wonder what it looks like on that. Because this game is just filled. I mean fucking filled with detail. Probably one of my game of the years, along with Witcher 3 and uh, Batman Arkham Knight. I have a lot of game of the years. Can't really decide on the best. But Witcher 3 is probably in my top two, I guess. I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to have to think about that and get back to you guys. What's your favorite game of the year? Leave a comment. I'm curious. Stop right there. Easy. 
Easy. You know I'm not with Trinity. Why should we believe you? I escaped with one of yours. A man named Jacob. Where is he now? We were together, but we got separated in the mines. She killed him! No! No, 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 no! Jacob would never trust an outsider. Please, listen, I am not your enemy. I warned you. You should have left. Sophia! Oh my god. There we go. Thank you. Father! What? That's her dad? Holy shit, it's her dad! Who the fuck I saw that coming? You. I'm glad you made it out of there. Go give Sophia, she is cautious. In her position, I'd be the same way. What did you find out? Trinity is coming in force. We must prepare. Her? We can be best buddies now, Sophia. On my word. No harm will come to her. These ruins. They must be near the Prophet's lost city. Come. We do not have much time. Prepare the weapon stores. Secure the battlements. Go. Now. They're almost here. But we're outnumbered. The children and elders are vulnerable. Go. Get them into the catacombs. Light the fires. The valley must be alert. Incredible. That's what I'm saying. Sophia, muster our fighters. Then meet me in the upper village. Don't disappear again, Father. There's much to do. If we had more time... Later. For now, I'll do what I can to help. Jacob's a good guy. I gotta give it to him. We're finally in the Valley of the Natives. That's what I'm gonna call it. This is where they sleep. This is where they lie. This is where they train. This is their home. And I must say, this is quite a home. I'd live here any day of the week, as long as I could bring my Xbox. So, how many natives are there? Let me just check my objective real quick. We got to investigate the valley. Okay, it seems easy enough. This, this episode's probably going to be extra short, guys, because I want to get a video up fast today to make up for uh, the lack of the uploads in the past two days. But I want to thank all you for coming to the video, watching, taking the time out of your day to watch my video, even though it's just somebody playing a game and talking about it. I want to thank you guys. Thank those 33 subscribers. You guys rule. Keep doing what you're doing. I just want to see what's up here real quick before I end it. I'm falling in love with this. Oh my god. You know, this reminds me of The Witcher. In so many ways. This is the type of scenery that I love. I actually prefer this over the snowy climate. Man, the amount of detail they took the time to put it into. You can get some side mission. I'll pick one up, but I'm not going to do it. We're trying to fortify as many of these towers as we can. Most of them were badly damaged in last year's floods. We've got the repairs in hand, but I need some extra supplies from around the valley. If we can get these towers repaired, it'll give us an advantage over the invaders, and it'll help us reach the upper levels of the ruined towers. Will you help? Maybe later, bruh. Maybe later. Just yet. Very well. I want to investigate the valley, because I'm curious, guys. I'm a curious human being. And I'm trying to figure out what the fuck, which way do we even go? I don't know, we'll figure it in the next one. But this is where I'm going to end the episode, guys. Extra short. Don't worry, there'll be another one coming fairly soon your way. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Make sure to leave a like down below if you did. My name is Mike. We're going to be back with more Rise of the Tomb Raider. And I'm out, guys. Peace.